For many Canadians, this long weekend not only signals the unofficial start of summer, but also camping season. If you're someone who wants the great outdoors while still enjoying some creature comforts, good news, glamping could be just what you're looking for. Arthi Pohl explains. The peaceful sounds of nature. For many, a camping excursion includes just the bare necessities and enjoying the great outdoors. Or you can do this. It's quite large, as you can see. It's tw about 20 foot across. A bigger, more luxurious tent called a yurt, complete with queen-size beds. These are beds with hotel linen? Yes. Queen-size beds? Queen-size beds. This is much better than sleeping, sleeping on bag. the cold, hard ground, yeah. The decor, a beautiful skylight and chandelier. That's right, you have electricity. Welcome to the world of glamping. Glamping is glamorous camping. So it's for those people that want to experience the outdoors, but don't necessarily want to be on the damp, cold ground in a tent. Not exactly roughing it. For the pampered camper, glamp sites like this one in Kitchener are popping up all over Ontario. It'll cost you $150 a night, and you can even request a chef or masseuse while glamping on the lake. And I wish it was around a few years ago. And nowadays, you can do it, and you can do it in style. At Mountain Equipment Co-op, they say the demand for high-end outdoor accessories is on the rise. We have a solar-powered charger that will uh, enough to power an iPod. We've got the French press. We've got smoked salmon jerky. We've got uh, wine glasses for both white and red. But not everyone is on board with the transformation in taking in the great outdoors. I think it follows on the theme of moving your living room outside now you're going taking your living room with you I think it's just a little bit too much perhaps but if glamping is for you you might want to act fast this spot only has a handful of weekends left open this summer Arthi Pohl CBC News Kitchener Ontario